Hi, it's Crea, your pod explorer, and I will show you how to create a simple skin for the Artifact Loot Pod, and how to set up one-click installation so that your skins are easy to scale inside on Cyber. Skins add a very nice aesthetic touch to your pods and are very straightforward to make, so today let's learn how to make a simple red color skin for the loot pod. First you need to download the GLB file for the loot pod. You can do this by checking the artifact creator guidelines on the official discord server. Once you have downloaded the loot pod model, open it in blender. Delete all these placeholders apart from placeholder 22, as we will use it soon to set up one click installation. In order to create a new skin, we need to make the walls of our new model thicker. To do this, we can use a very useful Blender modifier called Solidify. To use it, stay in Object Mode, select all the loot pod surfaces and join them together by selecting them and clicking Ctrl J. Then select the surface, go to Modifiers, add a modifier and select Solidify. Make sure Offset is set to 0 and increase the thickness to 0.05. If you get these weird textures, don't worry, just right click the model and select Shade Flat. By using this modifier, we basically made the walls thicker. Now you can add a new material to your model and change the base color to red. Make sure to be in viewport shading to see the new changes and delete the above material. If you want, you can also select other meshes by clicking C, then Escape and add a new material to apply different base colors. Now, to set up one click installation for your skin, all you have to do is delete all the empties and make sure to leave just your loot pod that you have merged earlier and placeholder 22. Select the placeholder, make sure to be in object mode, click object, click snap and cursor to select it. This way you have set the 3D cursor in the center of the placeholder. Now, since you won't need the placeholder anymore, you can delete it and select your loot pod. Go to Object again, but now go to Set Origin and click Origin to 3D Cursor. The last step is to align the Object Origin with the World Origin. Keep in mind that you may have to do some slight adjustments to get the perfect alignment. If you own a loot pod, you can even go to On Cyber, click this placeholder, select your skin and select the right size to make sure you get a perfect fit. Also, keep in mind that you may have to select a different scale for different skins to ensure the right fit. Check for part 3 to learn how to upload NFTs to OpenSea and how to mint multiple listings. 